Hey guys, welcome back to my channel, or if you are new, welcome to my channel. I hope you're having an amazing week. For today's video, I am very excited because we're gonna head out to the drugstore and I'm gonna walk you guys through a drugstore starter kit for beginners. Or even if you're not a beginner, you just wanna add some new additions to your collection that are affordable, I got you covered because I'm gonna put you onto all the goods, all my favorites, and just really amazing products that, like I said, even if you're not a beginner, these are just good additions to have in your collection. I actually did a video like this about two years ago at Walmart and a a lot of you guys really seem to enjoy it so I wanted to do an updated version this time I went to Target but honestly a lot of these things you can find at other drugstores as well including Ulta too I know Ulta technically isn't a drugstore but you know they have an affordable side so you can find some of these there as well so I hope you guys enjoy make sure you grab a snack get cozy and let's get into it I'm a big fan of eyeshadow primer and this one from Milani is great eight dollars and will make your eyeshadows pop and last all day and then as far as brows if you guys watch my videos you know that I am very particular with my brows brow routine so I like to outline my brows and use a pomade and all of that but I think if you're a beginner I would start off with just a good brow pencil or brow gel and this one from Oma Beauty is great so this actually comes with a brow gel on one side and a brow pencil on the other and I recommend just using this to enhance your natural brows and pretty much just follow along with your natural shape and if you like the look of a bolder brow I love the elf liner and brow cream in the shade espresso this one is my favorite I love this for filling in my brows it lasts all day it's super pigmented this is another great brow product it's from la colors it's literally 2.98 and you get three brow powders in here i love the black shade and yeah this is really good i got this last year i still use it for eyeshadows i also love these from milani you get some good variety in here so this palette here is the ungilded most loved mattes and this one has all warm matte shades perfect for so many different looks and these are really pigmented and the gilded nude is nice because you get a couple shimmers and glittery colors in here as well but still neutral and pretty this is a little bit more fun this is the gilded Terra. if you're into some pops of color love this one especially for spring and summer this is pretty now if you don't want to commit to a full-on eyeshadow palette these gilded minis are a nice option as well this one is in whiskey business and it has all neutral matte shades so this is really nice for every day and if you're into some cool tones this one in call me old-fashioned is a nice option and then these pinky hues are going to complement so many different eye colors and if you don't want to commit to a ton of eyeshadows and you want to just keep it super simple like the bare minimum of course the elf bite size shadows are always a nice option i like this one in i love you a latte because you get actually all matte shades cream and sugar is another one of my favorites you get some shimmers i've honestly tried all of these and they're great it just depends on what you like but double thumbs up for the bite size shadows and they're three dollars these eyeshadow quads from oma beauty amazing 10 out of 10 this is like a high-end formula and they're on sale which is insane because the quality is top tier look at these tones so beautiful and if you want an easy eyeshadow look you can take one of these liquid eyeshadows from nyx and just swipe it all over your lid and it's gonna give you such a gorgeous glowy sheen they last really well and they're just so easy so i really like this color in grapefruit glow i love the ColourPop super shock shadows as well because they're so easy you can just take these and apply them all over your lid with your finger and just add a little bronzer in your crease and you have a simple everyday eye look this milani lash extensions mascara will separate your lashes and make them look so long definitely recommend this is a good dupe also for the thrive cosmetics tubing mascara for 13 dollars. and the elf big mood the waterproof version specifically actually holds your curl and will last all day another mascara that i love that's a little bit more affordable is from essence the lash princess i like the original but i do hear a lot of people say that this smudges so the waterproof version is amazing as well these endless silky eye pencils also from pixie are super creamy and pigmented this reminds me of a high-end formula and for me i think black and brown are necessary you cannot go wrong and these are good for so many different looks they're just staples i know i mentioned the pixie liners but these from essence are five dollars a little bit more affordable and also a creamy pigmented formula i like the shade black love this one also comes in a brown version but first espresso which i also like super creamy but my favorite color in these essence liners is the nude one this one is in silky nude this is the best nude eye pencil it makes your eyes look bright and awake and it's a little bit less harsh than using a white eyeliner so try this one out it's my favorite again it's in silky nude and it's gonna look good on everybody this liquid liner from nyx is so good waterproof very black and makes applying your winged liner super easy it also has a brush tip but it's really easy to apply no one talks about this super precise eyeliner from essence but this is so black it dries down to a matte finish and it's also waterproof i have tested this out and it's amazing if you guys remember the nyc liquid liner i don't know if anybody 
used to use that but this is pretty much the closest thing to that if you're into false lashes the ardell demi wispies are a classic these are gonna look like your lashes but better super natural lightweight and easy to apply the band is flexible and thin and you can actually reuse these and if you have bigger eyes or you want something a little bit longer the original wispies are the best option they're kind of like the demi wispies but these are pretty much a little bit more enhanced and this is one of my favorite things about coming to walmart is their lash section i think they have the best variety when it comes to false lashes so i'll show you guys some of my favorites starting off with the kiss number 11s these are super similar to the demi wispies from ardell oh wow they actually have the demi wispies right there but these are from salon perfect they're all very similar they're really seamless when you apply them the pompadours are also a really pretty option you can see they're pretty much just like the 11s but they are a little bit thicker and like darker and then i love the pixie lashes these kind of taper on the ends and they're so flattering and they're slightly longer than the number 11s so they're all similar but they have little tiny differences but i love them all i still use these to this day and of course there's some other more dramatic lashes that are also really pretty oh these are a nice little beginner option too if you want to just try one pair the ritzies from kiss beautiful and they're three dollars for lash glue i always recommend the kiss strip lash adhesive this is the best and i always definitely recommend getting it here at walmart because it's the cheapest but if you don't want to deal with lash glue i understand it's a hassle sometimes i recommend this kiss lash glue liner it pretty much dries clear and you just apply it as if it was eyeliner but then you just pop your lashes on and they will stick instantly and also last all day so i really like the clear one and it also comes in black as well this bear with me spray is just a good go-to spray to have to melt in all of your makeup you can use it to prime your skin to refresh it or to set your makeup and just melt all of your products in it's sort of like mac fix plus but you can also use it as a setting spray too and this is my number one most used and most loved setting spray milani make it last i will always recommend this to everybody because it's going to work for all skin types and it truly makes your makeup last all day i like to use it before like i start my primers and after to set everything into place and it's the best stay all night microfine setting mist is another great option from elf and this is a good urban decay all-nighter dupe and the dewy coconut setting mist is similar to the stay all night microfine setting mist that i showed you guys at target but this one will give you a nice natural dewy finish and the power grip primers are going to be great if you want that grippy tacky texture i love the original and the one with niacinamide the one with niacinamide is slightly more hydrating and glowy on the skin but they're both going to give you that tacky finish and make your makeup last all day and if you have large pores or you just want to mattify and smooth your skin out before makeup the matte putty primer from elf is my favorite i love the original too they are completely out of stock of this product here but i figured i would give this an honorable mention as well the elf sun touchable woe glow this is great under makeup as well if you mix this in with the power grip your makeup will last all day it's my favorite skin prep at the moment so this is going to give you a glow but it's also going to hydrate your skin and it's beautiful under so many different foundations this is one of the best moisturizers before makeup or just in general it's from honest beauty great for all skin types not greasy you can use it in the morning at night before makeup and it's pretty much like a drink of water for your skin not even kidding i love their melting eye balm also again i like to use this at night but even before i start my makeup it's really hydrating and then can sealer and everything applies beautifully over top of this and if you have oily skin you will love the nyx can't stop won't stop foundation great coverage long lasting like truly one of the most long lasting foundations that i own and for my guys and girlies who love more of just a natural finish and you don't want something matte you just want something that's breathable lightweight but still has nice coverage the pretty fresh foundation from ColourPop is it this is extremely hydrating but it just looks like your skin but better it's very fresh and pretty and it lasts really well i actually like this specifically with the elf poreless putty primer such a nice combo another walmart option is the oma beauty by sharon c skin perfecting foundation this is going to give you a natural dewy finish it's not too dewy still long lasting though and has really great coverage and this is actually on sale right now at walmart typically this foundation is $14.99 and it's literally 50 percent off so definitely recommend this makeup revolution irl filter finish concealer is amazing it does have a soft matte finish but it still feels comfortable and natural on the skin it also wears beautifully the nyx bear with me concealer serum is another great option this is so hydrating and it's basically like skincare and makeup in one it's really nice coverage and you could also use this as pretty much your foundation if you wanted to very hydrating formula if you have dry under eyes you're gonna love this 
And another forever favorite concealer that I will always recommend is the e.l.f. Hydrating Camo. I think the original is nice, but I personally prefer the satin finish. Super creamy and this lasts really well and I think a little bit goes a long way. So this is always a nice option. One of the most blurring powders is the ColourPop No Filter Setting Powder. This one's in the shade Translucent. Looks great in photos, smooths you out, and it's great for your under eyes or for setting your entire face. And if you like a glowy, luminous setting powder, definitely try the elf halo glow i like the color light and light pink it gives you such a soft airbrush finish i love this also for the under eyes because it gives a little bit of brightness and the nyx can't stop won't stop mattifying powder is amazing to set or touch up your makeup and it's a really great dupe for the charlotte tilbury press powder another good dupe alert is the milani liquid contour this is a great alternative to the charlotte tilbury contour wands i honestly like these more they're ten dollars this is the lightest and the darkest shade they come in four shades total they don't have the other two in stock but these are going to give you some really good color they're blendable creamy and it's just a really good formula honestly you cannot go wrong with these the honest beauty cream cheek and lip colors are also really beautiful this is a dewy buildable formula so if you're into clean beauty this is a good option the color rose pink is actually my favorite too this is just good for every day milani's baked blushes are definitely also superior the color dolce pink is stunning a really nice pink with some gold shimmer to it so it gives you a glow and it gives you some color and and also luminoso is a classic this is more of a peachy golden blush but oh my gosh i love this color it goes with so many different looks the cheek kiss cream blush formula from milani is also amazing these are so pigmented and vibrant on the skin also very long lasting coral crush is also beautiful but they're super vibrant so a little bit goes a long way i love this formula the putty blushes is another formula that you can't go wrong with i like the original and the luminous putty blushes too oh they have some over here actually yes so if you're into a glow you're gonna love the luminous version this shade maui is my personal favorite it's like a pink with a gold shimmery sheen but the matte version is going to give you that pigment that wash of color the color bora bora stunning nice bubblegum pink the shade bahamas is also one of my favorites here is another walmart option for cream blushes these are from af94 it's a cheek and lip tint i love the pigmentation and the formula of these so pretty and another blush option this one is here at walmart and this is the covergirl true blend so flushed blush they have nice bronzers too but their blushes are nice they're pigmented and very vibrant they have a lot of pops of color but also some lighter shades too like look at that orange shade so gorgeous but then also this berry color and temptation is really pretty so this coral crush shade is really nice i also like this one in love me it's like a light baby pink with a little bit of like a golden sheen to it and then this radiance palette is beautiful for a nice glowy cheek you can use these also as eyeshadows or use them as blush toppers when i first tested these out i wasn't a huge fan of them but these have really grown on me and i think that it's a really great value honestly for everything that you get if you like a natural glow from within kind of look this essence pure nude highlighter will be the perfect addition to your makeup look it's not super glittery or anything it's very smooth and it just looks like you're glowing from within it's kind of like like the hourglass ambient lighting powder but this one is five bucks and i've been using this for years it's so nice before you start your makeup you always want to hydrate your lips and this collagen lip gloss from pixie is pretty much like a glossy hydrating lip balm it sort of feels like aquaphor 2.0 not sticky no scent to it but it gives your lips a lot of moisture so it's perfect before you start your makeup and if you need a pigmented transfer proof lip liner these from nyx are it specifically you have to get the one that says line loud lip lip liner though the shade global citizen is my favorite they're pretty out of stock of most of the shades but it's a great formula and it lasts so well and for lipsticks i have two options to show you guys that i think are the best formulas starting with the color fetish matte line from milani this reminds me of a high-end lipstick i love the shade selection the color tease and pleasure are my two favorites tease is a like beige nude color it has no pink undertone to it and then pleasure has that pinky nude undertone which is beautiful with so many different lip liners and the formula of this is like a matte suede but it's so comfortable and very pigmented for lip glosses i will always rave about the nyx butter glosses because i think the formula is not only amazing but the shade selection is perfect for everyone and anyone they have so many great colors but they're also not sticky and they pair really well with lip liner this is such a great universal lip gloss from pixie in the shade honey sheen you can wear this on its own with lip liner or 
or topped over any lip combo and it's gonna look so good i'm telling you this is gonna work on all skin tones it's such a beautiful shade it's minty not sticky and super smooth on the lips love this color you need it and they have other colors too but honey sheen is top tier and if you prefer a satin formula with your lipstick so you don't really want something matte these new o face lipsticks from elf are beautiful they have also really great shades they're just good for every day i'll show you my two favorites no doubt which is a nice nude based brown and then dirty talk is a nice nude pink these work with a lot of different lip liners and actually long lasting another good everyday product are these hydrating core lip shines from elf it's basically like a tinted lip balm they smell amazing and they're going to give you a little wash of color this one is actually one of my favorite shades in the shade happy i love this one they feel so nice on the lips and the packaging is super cute so these are also a nice option you can throw these in your purse you can put them over a lip liner or even just on their own they're super hydrating and these are my favorite glosses over my favorite lip combos from walmart the la colors holographic iridescent lip glosses but you have to get these two shades the pink one on the bottom is in sugared and then the one up top is in heavenly do you guys see that gorgeous glitter they're super smooth when you put them on though you don't feel the glitter on your lips and these are the prettiest topper glosses over any lipstick or lip liner too so i love these i have to shout them out because they're literally two dollars and that is officially it for this drugstore starter kit i hope you enjoyed i will of course have all the products that i mentioned linked for you guys down below in the description box let me know if you have any drugstore must-haves if i missed anything let me know. Thank you guys so much for being here and hanging out with me. Please do not forget to subscribe before you leave for new videos every single week. And I will see you very soon in my next one. Bye.